Welcome to Guided Meditations with Sri Devla. This is a space for you to connect with your own self, to connect with your breath. This is a space for you to connect with the Mother Earth, the universe and the divine energies. Release all the energy blockages that stops you from living a fulfilling and phenomenal life and receiving divine healing and powers from the source, from the universe, from your angels and guides and so many magical beings that are here to help you. We are about to start a guided meditation for this meditation, make sure that it is safe for you to close your eyes as you will be closing your eyes. Make sure that you are all by yourself in a room and you are not disturbed for the next few minutes. You can put your phone on silent mode or the flight mode and just sit in a comfortable position. You can even listen to this lying down in a comfortable position. Make sure you have some water near you and you are comfortable. And once you're ready, you can begin. Close your eyes. And with your eyes comfortably close, take a long deep breath in and let go. Breathe in from your nose, breathe out from your mouth three times. And as you start breathing normally, Observe every breath going deeper and deeper. Your eyes are closed. Your physical body is beginning to relax. Your mind is becoming quiet and calm. As you are beginning to go deep into a relaxation which is very comfortable and very soothing. Breathe in and breathe out. With each and every breath, just allow yourself to relax and then relax a bit more. You're listening to my sound and any other voice that you hear at the background will help you to focus on the sound of my voice only. Breathe in and breathe out. Bring your awareness to your physical body. Just observe your body. Some of you may begin to notice that your bodies have started doing better. As we allow the stream of bright white light through our body every day, as we connect with the energy of the earth and the universe and the angels every day, your body is healing. So many so-called future ailments has already been released and some are releasing. Just 
just observe your body right from the tip, top of the head all the way down to the tips of your toes connecting yourself with the mother earth our mother is the first guru that we have in our life the child learns a lot from the mother and the learning begins right from the point of time we are in the womb So today let us clear our energies with our mother and with mother earth So with your mother as much as you have learned from her yet anywhere you tried to heal her anywhere you tried to understand what was not working in her life and everything you picked from her that is not contributing to you anymore anywhere you made her the god of your life let all of that release today let it all release from your body let it all go to the mother earth and everywhere you judged your mother and any energy you have with her that is not contributing anymore let that release as well four powerful phrases that heals very powerfully perceive the energy of your mother and say i'm sorry if i have ever judged you if i have ever projected and expected you to be anyone other than who you are and not valued it i'm sorry please forgive me as i know now that you are an eternal being too on your own life path and you don't have to be perfect for me thank you for everything you have done and been for me I love you. Just embrace her. And let her go now. Wherever she chooses to. thank the mother earth connect with the energy of the mother earth and say i'm sorry for ignoring you for so long for never even realizing how much you are being for me 
प्लीज फॉर गिव मी फॉर बींग सो केयरलेस टूवर्ड्स यू फॉर टेकिंग यू फॉर ग्रांटेड थैंक यू फॉर टेकिंग केयर ऑफ मी एंड आई लव यू and as you say that the earth rejoices and that fills the earth up with the energy of joy and the desire to gift more to you allow that energy to come all the way from your feet through every cell of your body filling you up with all the gifts the mother earth desires to give you all the way to the top of your head and out of your head to the universe expanding your awareness beyond the earth beyond all the planets and galaxies connecting yourself with the universe some people may not perceive this energy as sky yet it is so beyond the sky as it comprises of so many skies like that yet it is the energy of the universe which is the fatherly energy so first connect with your own father's energy of this life and like the universe fathers many time quietly just provide to us staying invisible as they are mostly out working to provide for the family and many times as they are invisible they are out working for the family that may arise questions and doubts and feeling of not having him around yet we don't realize that him not being around is the gift he is being because he is somewhere working for us so today just ask your father just say to him i'm sorry i'm sorry for all the judgments i've ever had for you i'm sorry for projecting and expecting you to be the god of my life i'm not i'm sorry for not valuing everything you've done for us for me you did your best you did whatever best you could do you are my second guru after my mother as i learned the love and relationship and joy and gifting from the mother you tried to teach me discipline and work and so many things that are important to be in this reality and i just that all as wrong as they were uncomfortable yet today I seek your forgiveness. Please forgive me for always judging you. For all those times that I judged you. And today I thank you for everything you have done for me and the family. whatever i am today i am because of you you went out to provide for the family for the food for the education and you did your best 
thank you. And I love you. And just embrace your father. And allow his energy to go to wherever it belongs, bringing your awareness to the universe. The ultimate provider. Some people may call it as almighty or God or source, whatever name we may give to it yet. Sometimes when we are in uncomfortable situations, which are also helpful to us, yet we may just complain even to the universe or to the God. So today, just allow yourself to connect with that energy and say, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for all the why did you make it happen to me that I have thrown for you out there. I'm sorry for not letting what you wanted to gift me to come my way as I always doubted myself in you. So I'm sorry for not trusting you. I'm sorry for always complaining that whatever you've given me is less. And not realizing that I am receiving based on my own actions and my own capacity. And please forgive me for expecting you to give me beyond my actions and capacity. Thank you for always having my back, no matter what. I love you. As I get that pure divine unconditional love is the essence of this universe. It's that force that creates the attraction. And I choose to have that unconditional love now for myself, for you, the universe, the earth, and everyone around me. The universe expands in joy and thrill. Allow that energy to flow all the way through all the universes to come to you like a stream of bright white light coming all the way to the top of your head flowing slowly and gradually through every cell of your body releasing everything that stops you that blocks you from being your own guru. All the doubts and fears that stop you. From trusting your own self. Trusting your own awareness. And being your own guru today. Let them all release. 
And while this divine white light is flowing through your body, releasing these energies, just expand your awareness beyond your body, being present with all the angels, the guides, the ascended masters, all the gurus from your previous lifetimes and your current life. the beings of light, the nature beings, all the beings contributing to you are all there. them all for contributing to you and showing up in your life when you required when you asked for them and you were ready to receive from them So many times they contributed to you without even letting you know or projecting at you that they are doing something great, but they have always been contributing as all they want is you to have a phenomenal life. Allow yourself to receive the divine contribution and blessings from all these beings. And yet, if in this life or any other lifetime you have had anyone that you have perceived as a guru, and you have had a relationship of control with them, allow this divine energy of so many powerful beings to cut those cords. So a true guru always show up with the energy of unconditional energy, unconditional love. to gift you what you require, when you require it. There may be an energy exchange, yet a true Guru is ready to move on when the disciple is really ready. So allow yourself to be free from all the promises, vows, oaths, if you've ever made in any lifetime to any guru. And let all of that dissolve in this white light. Free yourself from the shackles of any promises, vows, oaths. You don't owe anything to anyone. You are an infinite being too. And so is anyone else who has had a physical body on this plane. No one is bigger or smaller than anyone. They may just know what you required. Be grateful for the contribution And any other emotion you have ever had for anyone, anyone you ever learned anything from, just let all of those emotions release. All of those thoughts, feelings and emotions released. 
You don't require such thoughts, feelings and emotions in your space anymore. So as this divine white light move all the way from the top of your head to your entire brain, your forehead, your face, releasing all the thoughts you have ever had for anyone you've ever learned anything from. Let that all release. Yeah, even the tiny minuscules one that you had for your teachers growing up. Moving all the way to your throat. Releasing the energy blockages of all the emotions that are stuck there as you suppressed everything you ever wanted to say to your gurus, to your teachers, that you did not. Let that all release. and simultaneously releasing the energies from your ears. Everything anyone you have regarded as your teacher, mentor, guru, coach, and everything they ever said that is not for your highest and best, that does not resonate with your frequency yet, you heard it and that is still there in the cellular memories of your ears, let that all release. Whatever it is, but everything that you ever heard that is not contributing to you anymore, let all of that release from your ears. Moving all the way to the shoulders. Releasing all the burdens and responsibilities that were projected at you. Either as a guru yourself in any lifetime or from any guru, let all of that release. Moving all the way to your hands, your arms, your fingers. Releasing all the energy blockages where you think you have to do things because of something. Release all of that and allow the ultimate choice to come to you. Moving all the way to the chest area, the heart, the lungs. Releasing all the stones you've ever kept on your heart, the boulders, the heaviness. As in this life or any other lifetime you've ever gone beyond your own inner voice to oblige someone else. Let all of that release. Let your heart be light. Moving all the way to your entire digestive system. your solar plexus, owning, claiming, and acknowledging your power. So anywhere you've given your power away,
you are an infinite being you are the source of your life and yes there are so many beings in the body and without the body that you can receive from and that are there to contribute to you yet when it comes to your life you are the power no one else the divine white light moves through the entire back your spine healing your spine releasing all the energy blockages that ever got created as you gave anyone else the power to stand for you or have your back but everywhere you gave up your own back let that all release healing your spine vertebrae vertebrae by vertebrae filling you up with confidence with trust in self and power moving all the way to your tailbone the root chakra and today let all these divine energies that are there around you heal your root chakra if anything has ever been done to you in this life or any other lifetime where someone try to take your power away your survival away let all of that be healed and let your power to be on the earth come to you there are very powerful beings ascended masters and guides that are working on your root chakra right now releasing any and all the energy blockages that stops you from being totally present in your life and your body and take charge of your life moving all the way to your thighs your knees your calves
releasing all the energy blockages that stops you from going ahead, from taking the actions, from standing for your own self. or for standing for you, for what you believe in. Let all of that release. Moving all the way to your feet. And to the Mother Earth. Allow this divine white light to flow and continue flowing from the top of your head all the way down to the tips of your toes and out of your toes to the Mother Earth. From the universe to the earth through your body. Releasing all the blockages, the locks that were ever there. that stops you from trusting yourself from knowing yourself as the infinite being you are and as an infinite being it's not that you are less and they are more and you need from them. It's all about the simultaneity of gifting and receiving. As you receive gracefully from your angels, you are also gifting them. By being who you be, as you receive from them, fulfilling their purpose so it's always a simultaneity of gifting and receiving just allow yourself to expand let this divine white light expand beyond the physical body healing all your energy bodies and expanding your ex energy bodies, expanding your own energy, releasing any resistance you have to be your own guru. And you can repeat with me, I am my own guru. I choose to coach myself with love and commitment. I choose to coach myself with practical love and commitment. I choose to coach myself with unconditional practical love and commitment. Take a long deep breath in and let go. Thanking all the gurus, all the angels, spirit guides, ascended masters, divine beings that are all around you right now, contributing to you. Thanking the Mother Earth, thanking the universe, Thanking the collective consciousness.
bringing the awareness to your own physical body. Right from the top of your head, all the way down to the tips of your toes. Being present with your body, your life, moving your hands and your feet a little bit. You can rub your palms, put them on your eyes. And slowly and gradually, as you feel comfortable, you can open your eyes. Have some water, stay relaxed. Make sure that you write your experience of the meditation, journal your experience of the meditation. And if there is any heaviness that you're experiencing or any discomfort in the body, don't worry about it at all. It's only the energy, intense energy is releasing. It will be fine in a while. Just have some water and relax and just share your experience with me in the comments below. I would also like to hear from you what are the other areas of your life that I can contribute to through these meditations. This is Sri Dengla and I am very happy and humbled to be able to connect you with yourself, with your breath, with your angels and for more meditations, just let me know in the comments and I would love to create more videos of these wonderful meditations for you. Thank you. Have a great day ahead and stay blessed.